Hi everyone, today we're going to study mean time between failures. The mean time between failures or MTBF is a concept which is frequently used in reliability work. It is defined to be the average or expected lifetime of an item. Alternative notation is capital E of T. Then from the definition of a mean or expected value, we have this formula. MTBF equals the definite integral from 0 to infinity. The variable T times F of T. Then DT. This F of T is the probability density function. Alternatively, we have this formula for MTBF equals the definite integral from zero to infinity. Of this quantity, one minus capital F of T, then DT. This capital F of T is the cumulative probability function. We most commonly express the mean time between failures in terms of the reliability function. Namely, this is the formula. MTBF equals the definite integral from 0 to infinity of capital R of T, dt. These are the three formulas for the mean time between failures. Let us see this example. Determine the MTBF of the failure density function f of t is equal to 0 0.2 minus 0 0.02t, where t is between 0 and 10, where t is in years. Let us write our formula for the empty BF. So this is about the small f of t. Substituting the corresponding values, we have now like this. Empty BF is equal to the definite integral from 0 to 10. And this is the variable t times the value f of t. We have this value and we substitute it here then dt. Let us simplify first by getting the product of this variable t with a function f of t. So we have now this 0 0.2 times t minus 0 0.02 t squared. Now let us do the integration. This 0 0.2 t becomes 0 0.2 times t squared over 2 minus this function here becomes 0 0.02 times t cubed over 3. Then we will evaluate this from 0 to 10. So it becomes like this. The first group is about this function and the variable t is changed into 10. Minus the second group, this same function where t is replaced by 0 respectively. Look at the second group. Because of the 0, all of this becomes 0. Let us simplify the first group only. So we have now this 0 0.2 times 100 over 2 minus 0 0.02 times 1000 over 3. Simplifying each of the fractions, we have now 10 minus 6.7, and the difference is 3.3. .3. And we say that this is in years. It means the mean time to failure of the item is just over 3 years. This is the final answer. I hope you learned something from this video, 
see you again next time